I'd make the most of a Hi everyone! So I uploaded a plan with me using our Erin Condren kits in the Happy Planner and I asked you guys if you wanted to see uh, me doing another plan with me using just the leftovers from that kit and um, a lot of you guys wanted to see that so that's what I'm doing today. If you haven't seen that video yet, I'll leave a link down below to that um, but I can just show you really quickly what the spread looks like. So as you can see, it's a pretty full spread. Um, I just don't think that it's really missing any stickers. Um, and I got everything that I needed from that kit, but I still have a lot of stickers left and I really think that I could do another um, full week's worth of spread using just the leftovers. I may need to add in a little bit of washi, maybe, but I'm going to try my best to just use these stickers only. Um, and it's going to be quite interesting because I've never done this before. I decided to use the Erin Condren planner today just to kind of mix it up because um, I haven't used this in a long time and last week's plan with me was in my happy planner so um, yeah, uh, I, that's pretty much the only reason I just did not think that it was necessary to do this in the happy planner again because it's pretty much the same thing um, if you don't know, the dimensions of the happy planner and the Erin Condren vertical planner is pretty pretty much the same. Um, the only real difference is the height of these boxes and um, that there's a gap in between the days. So I'm just gonna get started and I'm gonna put down these date covers first from Monday to Sunday. Okay, so the date covers are down. I'm gonna use these little flags to cover up those colors that are peeking through in the corners. I'm also gonna cover up this um, sidebar flag with this one, that's what this is for. And just use it to cover up that color. Perfect. So next I'm gonna go in with these to-do headers and these checklist flags at the very top. You know, I think I would like it better in the middle, so I'm actually going to move that down, place it in the middle instead. I think I just want to space out these texts because I don't have any more um, of these uh, written headers, so headers with the writing on them, and I think it'll look better when the, when the text is spaced out from... Um, the date covers at the top. So yeah, that's I think that looks that looks a lot better. To meet you. But so it happened we were lonely but so I am gathering all of my half boxes that I left and it looks like I've got three left so I'm going to space that out um, right across the week and I'm going to start with this black one in the middle of the week so I'll place it on Thursday at the bottom and then I'll place this gold one on Saturday and then this light beige one on Tuesday I have this checklist full box left and I'm going to place it in the side by the bottom here. And then right above that I'm going to use um, this header that says this week. And this will serve as my master to-do list for the week. If it's not straight, I'm going to place it in again. I also have all of these header covers from Kit A. Um, these are the header covers. And I'm just going to use it to cover up the um, very bottom row headers. I actually have a lot more of these header covers left 
and I'm not going to use a black color but I'm just going to use these bright colors and cover up the very top row okay so I'm going to go in with the details now um, keep in mind that this is uh, the same week that I've planned in the Happy Planner um, so the schedules are going to be the same I have a networking meeting on Thursday that I can write down this pen is a gorgeous crystal pen that I got in my um, Planner Society box I think it was the December one I can't remember actually I'm pretty sure it was this yeah could have been November I honestly can't remember <laughs> that rhymed Okay, so I wrote down networking meeting. I have a potluck dinner that I have to attend on Friday. I'm gonna use one of these meal planning stickers from Kit A and just place it at the bottom. And I'm actually just gonna grab one of these little hearts and place it right in front of the time. Like that. Very cute. I have an eye exam on Friday morning, so I'm going to grab one of these hexagons and I'm going to layer it over one of these little washi strips. And I think I'll just take this marble one, place it down like that with a bit of a gap, and then layer this hexagon on top. I hope I was in frame. Okay. <laughs> So that looks really good. I have a hair appointment also on Friday. So I'm gonna grab this quarter box and place it at the top box right beneath this and write down 1 p.m. Hair appointment. I'm going to grab these two task boxes from Kitsy and I'm just going to place it on Monday and Tuesday. I'm going to place it a little bit towards the bottom like that. And then write down when my help comes. I also have to take out the trash on Tuesday night. And to mark that in, I'm going to use one of these uh, task boxes with the, the little blank circle. I don't know if you can see. So yeah, that's the little blank circle task box. Um, I'm just going to place it here. So when I do take the trash out, I can just take that off. Today's Thursday. I'm just going to pretend like... I'm planning this in advance um, because this is just a way for me to show you how I'm using the leftover kits from the other plan with me. Um, so I got groceries on Monday and I'm going to write that in um, using one of these flashy strips. So I will use this one. Should I place it kind of towards the top? I had an appointment with a print shop yesterday, and um, that was Wednesday. So I'm going to grab one of these um, little task boxes and place it uh, towards the top. And then write in meeting. I also got my car wash that day, right after the meeting. So I'm going to grab one of these quarter boxes just to break up that aesthetic a little bit. So on Sunday I have church, so I placed in this clock icon from Kit A. So I'm just gonna write down 10.30. Church. So I'm gonna grab one of these little washi strips from Kit B and I'm just gonna cut off corners like this kind of to a point and place it on Sunday like that and in there I'm going to write laundry I cleaned the office yesterday so I'm going to take this vacuum icon 
and place it at the bottom on Wednesday and write in clean the office and bathrooms. I'm gonna go listen to some live jazz on Saturday evening um, and I have a little flag here that says date and I'm just gonna place it in the corner write that in on top of the um, half box and write in jazz night so I'm filming this on Thursday evening um, I just actually came home from the networking meeting but after filming this I'm gonna go and take a hot bath it's a bit late but I think that's what I'm gonna do to kind of unwind and relax so I'm gonna grab this task box with a little heart icon and I'm just gonna place it at the top I mean ideally it would have uh, been under the networking meeting sticker because I do like it somewhat chronological but it doesn't matter too much um, and I'm just going to write down bath time. I'm going to grab one of these meal planning stickers and then I'm going to cover up that, um, that icon with this little camera icon. Well, it's a big camera icon. Um, just like that kind of layered and write in new releases. So I placed in these two meal planning stickers in the sidebar for my meal prep this week. Um, one is chicken and then the other one is steak. I'm gonna layer in this header that says important over that flag in the sidebar. In hindsight I could have probably used um, a little washi strip instead of that flag but that looks okay too. <laughs> I'm going to use this top section as my personal master to-do list and then this bottom section as my work master to-do list. I am going to grab this little TV, oops, this TV icon and place it on Sunday evening. Um, and I'm just going to watch an episode of The Crown on Netflix. I'm going to film another plan with me on Saturday morning. I'm just going to write down I just realized that on Saturday at 6.30 there's going to be a game night with some friends. I'm going to grab the scalloped washi, place it at the bottom, like that, and this one too. I'm going to use this section as my keep in touch section so everybody that I need to call, text or email, um, I'm just going to write their names down at the bottom here. For example, I talked to my friend SJ yesterday, so Wednesday I can just write down SJ, arrow and write call. On Friday I'm just going to write down women's group. To remind them about our next meeting. And then I'm also going to write down a new intern. I just realized I have to wrap a birthday present for a friend and I'm going to do that probably yeah on Saturday morning so I'm going to Use this little task box with the present icon and write. Oops. Wrap book. Because I got him a book. I'm going to grab this hexagon from Kit A and place it on Sunday and write in. And I'm just going to fill out this master to-do list and some of the things that I did get done this week. Um, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I filled in all the details. 
and I also added in some extra stickers like these hearts and um, these washies that I cut in different shapes. I have some stickers left but not very much so I've got some headers and some task boxes, I've got some washi strips and header cover ups but that is pretty much it for this collection. I can't believe that I only use leftover stickers in this spread. Um, I know that it's a very white space look um, but for somebody like me this is just absolutely perfect. It, I just don't think that it's, you know, requiring any more stickers. Um, but let me know what you guys think because I know that different people have different planning styles um, and different planning needs and I don't know, this may not work for some of you but for a lot of you I think you would be able to stretch this collection over two different weeks. This was so much fun to film and um, I'm definitely going to be doing something like this again in the future. Because I have so many stickers, it's hard to use it all up. Um, but if I do more videos like this, even though the week is repeated, um, I think I'd be able to get through the stash a little bit faster. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed filming it and uh, I would really appreciate a thumbs up if you did. Alright, so it's really late and I should probably get going. I'm going to go and take a bath and um, get a good night's sleep because I have an early start tomorrow morning. I'll talk to you guys next time. Hope you guys take care. Hope you guys are happy and healthy. Bye!